Um, so what was happening, this was showing all green, all light solid, uh, red, yellow, and green, and it wouldn't start, and so it showed that uh, unable to set remote address. So we got Solar Assistant here, and if you've ever seen the issue where you could not uh, connect your inverter to it, uh, down here where you, uh, it was not uh, recognizing any USB ports, um, you can go click uh, the view detail uh, to see what the uh, detail is or the logging is about the USB devices. And sometimes it will say uh, cannot assign a address to USB device. And uh, some people say to uh, restart uh, the thing, hard, hard boot it, basically shut it down, leave it for a little while, start it up. That didn't work for me. What I did have is another USB cable. Um, and it seemed to um, uh, prefer a particular USB port of the four on the on the Raspberry Pi. And so what I did, I had another USB to serial cable. I plugged that in the same port where um, the uh, uh, the other serial cable was, uh, DB9 um, to uh, the RJ45 uh, connector, uh, and basically forced the unit to see a completely different USB uh, to serial device right there. Uh, and then when I unplugged that and plugged in the original unit, uh, USB to serial, uh, for the solar uh, assistant program, then it was able to assign the address. So uh, long story short, uh, find another uh, USB to serial cable, uh, plug it in the same USB slot, pull it out, uh, and uh, plug in the original one. And uh, for me, it started communicating again. So this is my uh, USB 3 to serial DB9 and then it connects up to, uh, this is an EG4 unit uh, with the RJ45 uh, network, basically Cat5 connector on the bottom there. Um, so what was happening, this was showing all, green, all light solid uh, red, yellow and green and it wouldn't start and so it showed that uh, unable to set remote address and it seems to like that particular USB uh, top right uh, plug for some reason. But anyways, I had this other uh, USB cable, which is for the, uh, the battery, to uh, get some statistics off the battery. And this is another USB to serial. So I just uh, unplugged to the, from the same port, I plugged this into the same port, and that forces the, the Raspberry Pi to, again, uh, try and associate a different address, and plugged it, uh, pulled it out and plugged that one back in, and that fixed it. And that was after a couple of days of uh, trying. So, so there you go. Hopefully uh, that helps the next person try a different uh, serial cable which is going to force it to try and reset uh, the address.